here's a video that will be helpful for anyone who is planning on putting a home addition or a room addition on. You have an existing two-story house with a set of winder stairs and you're going to put a, a room addition on the other side and you're trying to figure out just how in the heck I'm going to get the stairs to work and I got a couple of I got a couple of ideas that'll make it easier um, for you and this is actually a project that I did. I did a I did a room addition. I designed it and built it and I had an existing set of winder stairs and basically what you're going to need to do is um, get rid of the winders and turn it into a platform and uh, to do that you can tear the stairway apart and uh, rebuild it and this is what actually what I did. I just simply took the stair I uh, left these stairs here and then put the landing in and then had the stairs going up in both directions. Um, but, and you're going to need to make sure that you can actually do that. So a lot of times with a winder set of stairs, um, you're going to have a head out that's going to be a little closer here. And if you need to move it back further um, because you need to add, add one or two more steps, then, and you don't have the room or the framing is a nightmare, that could actually be a problem for you. So keep that in mind. I'm not going to show you, go over all the structural details in building it, just more or less give you a few design ideas. And for those of you who might be able to do some basic carpentry or remodeling, uh, you should be able to you should find these videos uh, helpful. So this is one way to do it. This is a way that you're probably not going to be able to do it. Now, the reason why I drew this one in here, you could leave the winders and do something like this, is because I saw it one time. I never built it. I saw this one time in a picture, and it was in an older home. And uh, I was doing some research on older homes, and I came across this. I go, I thought this was a neat idea. And I, I'm, they could have built it originally. It could have been a... Um, they put, built, built a home addition on the side a long time ago. People were pretty creative. And uh, I'll give you another view of it here. People are pretty creative. And uh, this is just, I had to throw it out there. You know, if your building department would approve something like this, this could be the easiest solution to your problem here. So something like this um, wouldn't work in my opinion because it's not going to meet the landing or the step uh, requirement. So if they consider this a landing, it would need to be 36 inches by 36 inches. If they consider this a step, then it needs to be 10 inches for residential stairs. And you could see here where it would not meet that requirement the minute uh, or once we got closer to the corner here. So you would almost have zero right here. So I think that's that would be your big problem with that one. And of course, here's a, just a method to where you could keep the um, platform if this would work, if they would allow something like this. You could keep the, the winder step, fill this in, um, you know, fill this area, make the modifications for this, and then have a um, landing here. And of course, you could always make this bigger if they would buy it. You could always move this farther this way if they said, hey, we need 36 inches. Well, then just move this set of stairs a little farther that way if you can to get the 36 inches here. So you would have the 36 inches here. You would just need to get 36 inches here. And that actually might work. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at another view of it here. So I really can't see. If you could get 36 inches here and you had 36 inches here, I really don't see where that would be a problem. Could be a little confusing, uh, you know, to use, but might not be a problem. Now this one here might make a little more sense. You can see here where this was the winder step. This would have been the riser for the this. This would have been the riser up to this step. So this is filled in and this area is filled in. And then this area would have been removed because this here would have been the last, um, the other riser for the step here. So this one here should work as long as you have 10 inches. So I could see where this could be a problem here. If you had your, whatever your minimum tread width is here, um, that could be a problem. 
with, uh, you know, it might be sticking into the wall here a little bit. And that might be okay. Your building inspector might approve that as long as this stairway still provides you with 36 inches. So don't let that discourage you. And of course, here we raised the stairway up and filled the landing in. And again, just uh, did a little more modifications, did it a little different to get what we wanted it to look like. Instead of uh, tearing everything apart, you might actually be able to just do some modifications to the stairway to get it to work. Um, you know, especially if you're going to do something where you're going to put carpeting or something over it. You know, if you're going to use um, hardwoods or something like that, or um, something to where making the modifications might put put a a, a hump in the wood or make it uh, where where it's not perfectly flat, something like that. That could be a problem. I know a lot of people, they just come in and they just rip it out, and that's what I would do. You come in and rip it out, make the, you know, rebuild it um, to where the best you can. That way you don't have to worry about any of these imperfections. But again, that's why I'm throwing these ideas out there. Just kind of throwing some different ones out there. If you have an existing stairway like this and uh, you need it to look like this. Now you have a few more ideas. And uh, again, you might not ever run across something like this. I only came across this once and um, figured it out. And I think most people are going to be able to figure out what they need to do. That's not really um, too complicated. But uh, for those of you who just needed one picture, one example, and it helped, let us know by hitting the thumbs up button.